Hello everyone. I welcome you all in this video lecture. In this video lecture, we will study about electric traction drive and advantage and disadvantage. First of all, let us start understanding what exactly we mean by electric traction drive. We use electric motor for the purpose of traction in locomotive. We use DC series motor or single phase or three phase induction motor for the purpose of traction. To give the supply to the electric motor, we use overhead distribution line from the grid system or nearby substation provided for the traction purpose. We can collect current from the overhead conductor by means of bow collector or pantograph. Torque is generated that can be utilized for propelling the train. Now let us start uh, considering advantage of using electric drive compared to all other locomotives. Electric drive is very neat and clean compared to steam engine or any other drive and it is ideally suitable for underground and tube rails. In case of electric drive, a higher rate of acceleration and retardation is possible. Normally 50% to 100% higher rate is possible and as a result it can have a very higher scheduled speed compared to steam engine. Better and efficient speed control can be achieved in case of electric drive. In case of steep gradient with slow speed, locomotion is possible. It can exert very higher torque compared to steam traction and it can handle higher traffic density or more number of passengers. It can be operated in sections to suit traffic density. Maintenance and downtime for maintenance is very less compared to steam engine. No preparation time is required and as a result it can be put in service without any delay at any moment of time it can start its operation. It is most economical traction for higher traffic density and where electricity is available and cheaper. It requires less terminal space, small workshop and a shed. It can exert uniform and continuous torque and that is why vibrations are very minimum and comfortable journey is possible. No consumption of fuel it require only electricity but at a moment it does not consume any fuel so high grade fuel that can be utilized for any other industrial purpose. Better coefficient of adhesion and as a result weight to HP ratio reduce. It can handle temporary overload condition also. 
power distribution system can be used for tracks that can also be used for rural electrification without any additional cost regenerative braking is possible so while braking the energy can be fed back to the supply so these are some of the advantage of using electric drive now let us see certain disadvantages also the initial expenditure is very high especially for the track electrification it requires a very high capital investment and to prepare substations at a different uh, definite uh, interval failure of electric supply even for a couple of minutes it can create a very high discrepancy and dislocation of the traffic it can be operated only on electrified routes at all other part or other sections it cannot be used it has to follow severe statutory rules and regulations of the electrification ac traction system causes interference in nearby communication line and we require special arrangement for the suppression of this interference additional equipments are required for regenerative braking in case of a dc series motor is used and because of this weight and cost might increase so these are some of the advantage and disadvantage of using electric drive compared to other type of locomotives thank you for watching my video keep watching thank you very much